Well, yesterday at 4, we first told you how DeKalb County would not provide an ambulance to a woman who thought she was having a heart attack. Well, today, the county's director of public safety avoided our tough questions, canceling an interview at the very last minute. Yeah, William Miller had agreed to sit down with us today to explain the whole thing, but he changed his mind. 90-year-old Marie Jones called for help Monday at the Atrium Retirement Facility off Shambly Dunwoody in DeKalb County. CBS Atlanta's Adam Murphy joins us now with an update to this story. He backed out of the interview, Adam. Backed out at the last minute, much to our surprise. Now, we want to go about talking about Marie Jones. She said she didn't get the immediate care from DeKalb County this week when she thought she was having that heart attack. So we did ask to sit down with the director of public safety today to ask him about the tough questions. CBS Atlanta went straight to DeKalb County's Director of Public Safety today to ask the tough questions about failing to provide ambulance service for 90-year-old Marie Jones. Emergency. Jones called for help Monday when she experienced severe pain in her arm that she thought might be the onset of a heart attack. 25 minutes later, DeKalb County arrived at her apartment but did not have an ambulance to transport her to the hospital. My tough question is how could this happen? How could new vehicles be available? How could we spend that much time waiting only to be told that we can't help you? CBS Atlanta spoke over the phone with DeKalb County's Director of Public Safety yesterday about the incident. He agreed to answer some of our tough questions today during an interview. But when we arrived, he canceled. And he said he didn't realize we had already aired our first version of the story yesterday. So William Miller sent us this email saying, quote, There is nothing I could add to my responses yesterday that would change or impact your story. As for Marie Jones, her son had to take her to the hospital once he realized DeKalb County did not have an ambulance available. And I told him how unhappy I was and that I would not let it go. Now, DeKalb County told us they had four other emergencies they were responding to at that exact moment, which is why they could not help out Jones. Now, I checked on ambulance services in both Gwinnett and Cobb counties, and they both told me they typically have roughly 24 ambulances on the street during a 24-hour period. And they said there's also a mutual aid agreement between all the ambulance services where if they need help, they can call on the other one for help at no cost if necessary. So one wants to know why DeKalb did not do that. We're live here in the newsroom. Adam Murphy, CBS Atlanta News. We found out about this story from a viewer just like you. If you have a story idea, email us at news at cbsatlanta.com.